Everyone makes mistakes, even superheroes. So even though the characters you see in comic book movies are some of the most effortlessly cool in fiction, it shouldn't come as a surprise to find out that the actors portraying them are every bit as capable of making a fool of themselves as you or I. They might be superhuman on film, but they're only human in real life, and human error is an inevitable thing. In this video, we'll take a look at 10 occasions in which bloopers occur during the filming of superhero movies. We hope you enjoyed this video, and make sure you subscribe to our channel to enjoy more like it. Here are 10 of the funniest superhero movie bloopers. <laughs> Blade Trinity 2004's Blade Trinity was the final movie in the popular Blade trilogy, and it saw a unique depiction of Dracula, referred to as Drake in the movie, as the villain. Portrayed by Dominic Purcell, Drake had a human form and a monstrous form, and he transformed into the latter to fight Blade in the final battle. Blade ultimately defeated Drake by injecting him with the Daystar virus, which results in him roaring in pain. The overdramatic nature of the reaction resulted in the actor playing him breaking down laughing, which is a funny thing to see in full monster prosthetics. Hello, I'm going to... <laughs> Spider-Man 3 Some people would argue that 2007's Spider-Man 3 was one big blooper. It really wasn't very well received, but there were some actual bloopers from the movie that have surfaced online, including one classic can't stop laughing incident. It's the scene in which Peter Parker and Mary Jane Watson are in the swanky New York restaurant and Gwen Stacy comes over to talk to Peter, irking Mary Jane. The blooper sees Tobey Maguire laughing uncontrollably, seemingly for no apparent reason, over and over again at different points in the conversation between him and Bryce Dallas. Alice Howard's Gwen. If we ever get out of this, Hellboy 2 The Golden Army In the Hellboy movies, the titular character, brilliantly played by Ron Perlman, is a dab hand in the use of his faithful four-round revolver, which is known as the Good Samaritan. However, Perlman did have some trouble with it on a couple of occasions. In 2008's Hellboy 2 The Golden Army, whilst talking to Abe Sapien, he failed to close the gun in an attempt to reload it in his usual nonchalant manner, and he even struggled to get it out of its holster in one instance. You listen well, brother. <laughs> I'm listening. The Avengers. There's an epic scene during the final battle between the titular team and the invading Chitauri army in 2012's The Avengers, in which both Captain America's shield and Thor's hammer return to the heroes at the same time. In the movie itself, both characters seamlessly catch their signature weapons and continue fighting, but a blooper shows that wasn't always the case for the latter. While Chris Evans's cap catches his shield in style, Chris Hemsworth's Thor fumbles Mjolnir and lets out a smile as he juggles it haplessly. Heartbreaker, will you help What's his name? Red Snapper. Iron Man 3. Remember that awesome scene at the end of 2013's Iron Man 3, when Robert Downey Jr.'s Tony Stark remotely called upon all of his Iron Man armors? Well, could you honestly name all of those armors individually? No? Well, apparently, Downey Jr. couldn't either. When he attempts to instruct the Heartbreaker armor to assist the Red Snapper armor in battle, he forgets the name of the latter and simply calls it What's-His-Name before turning to the camera, making a funny face, and saying Red Snapper when it finally comes to him. Thor, The Dark World We now come to our second Mjolnir blooper in this video, and this one comes from 2013's Thor, The Dark World. Chris Hemsworth doesn't seem to have much luck with Thor's iconic hammer. It comes after Odin orders Thor not to leave Asgard, but he attempts to do so anyway, so Asgard's forces are sent to stop the God of Thunder. A group of guards attempt to apprehend Thor in a doorway, and when the hero hits one of them with Mjolnir, the head of the weapon falls up, resulting in Hemsworth laughing and swinging the handle around humorously. You walked us right off the set! Yes, I did! <laughs> Come on! And I'm gonna do it again! Guardians of the Galaxy 2014's Guardians of the Galaxy was such a fun movie, it must have been an absolute hoot for the cast and crew to film it. And the bloopers can only have added to that, so here's one featuring Michael Rooker. Rooker's character Yandu Udonta was walking with Horus, another member of the Ravagers played by Tom Proctor, when they walked too far reaching the end of the movie's set, and Rooker lightheartedly shouted at Proctor for causing the mistake to happen. Huh? Assemble. Avengers Age of Ultron This particular blooper is unique on this list, as the mistake was made so many times that it appears the people behind the movie just gave up on the scene in question, and didn't include it in the final version. It came in 2015's Avengers Age of Ultron, and it's Mark Ruffalo's Bruce Banner trying to pronounce a bunch of scientific words and terms. We'll never know exactly what he was trying to say, as he never actually gets any of it out, but we'll let you have a listen for yourself anyway. Polysaccharide. 
Deadpool. Like the aforementioned Guardians of the Galaxy, 2016's Deadpool looked like it was a hell of a lot of fun to film. And with hilarious personalities like Ryan Reynolds on set, bloopers were always going to be pretty inevitable, especially when he had sex scenes to film. In one such scene, when Reynolds and Marina Baccarin are having some adult fun together, Reynolds just can't hold it together. His repeated thrusting causes him to break down laughing, which subsequently results in him asking for the cameras to stop rolling. Captain America Civil War There's a scene in 2016's Captain America Civil War in which Vision, while aiming to turn Falcon into a glider, accidentally hits War Machine mid-flight, which disables his armor, resulting in James Rhodes free-falling to the ground, hitting it with a bang, and being injured very badly. Tony Stark holds his limp, unconscious body as Falcon arrives to apologize, but Anthony Mackie didn't get his landing right every time during filming. In one instance, Mackie comes into land while hanging on some wires, but he manages to fall face-first into the ground. You think this is funny? Thanks for watching our video about 10 of the funniest superhero movie bloopers. Can you think of any other hilarious bloopers from superhero movies? Have your say in the comments below, and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more great videos like this one.